Good morning! Welcome, guys, gals, and non binary pals. You got anything to say, James? <sighs> um, this must be hard for you, too, Master Amber. It could be far worse. Yeah? My biggest fear is that Rachel will try to meet Sarah. That's why I, I said it. it. It would so probably be good to sit down with everybody and do it. You have no idea what pain Sarah's caused. Her That's... addiction has led her to do terrible things. I believe I it. I don't want Rachel to go through any of that. So talk to her. I I don't understand. Are you afraid that Sarah would do something to Rachel? I don't think she would deliberately harm anyone. But addicts can cause tremendous harm without meaning to. Yeah. But Rachel's not a baby anymore. Listen to me. Sarah brought criminals and drug dealers into our home. She put Rachel in serious danger just to chase her habit. Do you think yeah. Sarah is involved <clears throat> with any of the drug dealers around here? It wouldn't surprise me if she were. Well, we did see her coming That's out of Frank's RV. Is. Chloe, I believe Rachel trusts you more than anyone else right now. Is this where you yeah. ask me to manipulate Rachel into doing what you want? This is where I ask you to do as your conscience dictates. But please, put my daughter's safety first. I I still think that they should sit there. I will always do. They should Just sit down you. together, sit there, and talk terrible. it out. All of but them together. Protect her from that, please. I'll do what I can. I care about her too, you know. I know. Thank you. It's. <laughs> It's, it makes it even more dangerous that you're not willing to sit down and talk to her about all of this. You know she's going dis, like, to disregard what you said. She's going to disregard what you want for her. Because she wants this now. Hey, Mrs. Amber. I think it's Rose at this point. Considering everything. Yeah. Okay. Rose. Need any help? Do you need any help with... anything? That's very kind of you. Could you get out the broom for me? It's in the breezeway. Sure. Door to the left of the fridge. Breezeway? What the fuck's a breezeway? Is it this? Oh, oh, new shirt, hey. new clothes. Cool graphic. Rachel was for really donation. getting rid of this. Mine, mine, yoink. Mine now. Mrs. Amber, could I have this? Oh, sure, Chloe. Rachel was going to give it away anyhow. Thanks. Mine. New clothes. <laughs> I'm washing me and my clothes, bitch. Okay, I'm guessing you want the the table to be swept. Yes. Do I need to talk to you first, really? Broom. I don't know why the camera did that. I didn't do that. Um, here you go. Thank you. You're welcome. I'm really quite glad that you're here. Ooh, yeah. Let's hear your reason. Thanks. But why? While Rachel's dealing with all of this, it's a relief to know she can talk to you. How are you doing, Chloe? How am 
I doing? I'm Your doing pretty loves rough. to talk about how awkward different things are. Well, <laughs> what? This must be pretty awkward, I'd imagine. I mean, yeah. That's <laughs> that's awkward. Your generation likes to talk about awkward things. Uh, I'm doing better than your daughter. I guess I'm <laughs> not great. Rachel and I were really happy a few hours ago, and now... Maybe you can see why James wanted to keep this a secret. There are many painful things about Rachel's past. Yes and no. my own role in hiding the truth. Both of these are shitty choices. James, I would not say he, he lied, but he also, no, he did lie. Like, I get her feeling like this whole life is now a lie, but it's still like, Sarah it's shouldn't so have shitty. taken money over seeing her daughter. That, yeah. Uh, I am so thankful to her that she did. It gave me the opportunity to be Rachel's mother. I never knew how much I could love someone until I had Rachel. But hearing the truth after all these years hurt Rachel more than anything. Yeah, that's a risk I'm they not took. I'm happy with James for the whole way this came out. You're not happy with James? What about what he did at the Overlook? It might be hard for you to understand, but after 13 years of marriage, I'm not <laughs> threatened by what happened. You're right. Well, I w I don't understand. I don't think you that's... You don't have to worry about me or James. Rachel's the one who needs you right now. Do you think Sarah is dangerous? I've never met her, so I don't know. But I'm inclined to trust my husband. Yeah, he's real trustworthy. His entire life is about keeping people safe. Rachel's extremely fortunate to have him as her father. <sighs> Thanks. Thank you, Chloe. I... <clears throat> See again, I'm I'm torn. I understand why they did what they did, but like Rachel took that pretty hard. I should see if she's okay. But they still could have just like talked to her. Like this is why you should talk to your kids if you want them to trust you. You got to be honest with them yourself. I I grew up hating my parents because they didn't talk to me like I was an actual person they st honestly still don't I so I've you know disregarded them as parents since I was a kid I might not know her exact situation from the standpoint of she has grown up with different people than she was born from but it's like I don't know I get why they did it but this could have all been resolved so much earlier than it had Hey, Rach. I need some way to show Rachel that I'm here for her. How about saying I'm here for you? <laughs> okay. Uh, yeah. No, yeah. Rachel even knows how to make a dinky lamp look cool. That's great. Rachel's surrounded by so much love. Yet she seems so... Uh, alone. 
They came to her show, but didn't say anything afterward. Makes sense that Rachel needs two signs to contain her awesomeness. I shall call her Lion Crab from now on. Why wouldn't you- This light needs more light. Why wouldn't you come talk to your kid after they just put on their first show? Wonder what I could find around here to brighten up that nightlight. Rachel has so many inspirations, she oh can barely keep them all contained. Audrey Hepburn, Mary Wollenstonecraft. Probably pronounced that wrong, I'm sorry. Douglas Adams, Henry Kendall. I don't know who anyone put the first one is. The Ying and Hadass Yang of Rachel Amber. Before all else be armed. What? Sure. We were so close to making our break last night. Now... I don't know. You have a whole... med kit? In your room? Do you have two cartons of milk? What? Tell me that's not milk. Also, uh, Rachel, I hope you don't uh, mind me just snooping through your shit. Man, I'm sorry, Joyce. I'm dealing with some shit right now. It's not you. Is there a section on how to walk fours through batshit crazy family drama? No? Okay. I don't know what that means, but all right. I know something Miss Arcadia doesn't. Weird. Okay. Sure. <laughs> really? Why not? I think Rachel could use another subject. But which one? I can't get a little, get, get a little herb on. That's the one. Does it say? Hold on. I see. Page 420, puff, puff, pass, <laughs> 500 words. Okay. Ooh. Uh, what is that? Hard to believe the show was only a few hours ago. Seems like everything has changed since then. I don't know what that says. It's upside down. I'ma put them, I'ma put them nice. Or I'm just gonna take one, apparently, because <laughs> the other ones are. At least you'll have something from tonight. Sure. Why not take all of them? <laughs> okay, sure. Why not? <laughs> why not? Maybe Go for it. I can make the world a less scary place. Uh. Something I said to remind her of me. I said to remind her of me. Let me know if you need an accomplice. Okay. Weird, but all right. I've heard that Rachel and Nathan hang out sometimes. But it still seems hard to believe. He looks so different. And I don't know why. I would use the flashlight on the, the stars. I never had anything like this. Do they actually fit like that? I saw, uh, I think it was a TikTok. Uh, someone took a 
dollar store, one of these, and it was Halloween. Where did you put Rachel's that? Light show. Better get her attention first. Hey Rachel. Hey Rachel, how we doing? How we doing? Hey Rachel, I'm glad you're here, Chloe. Of course. Okay. <laughs> okay. Here, look. Pretties. But it's not going to spin. Because it's not on the rotating disc anymore. I used to have those glow-in-the-dark stars in my room. My mom hot glued them to the ceiling with one of her friends. It's... It's you still spinning. I thought you might like it. But it's I not on the rotating stars. disc anymore. Why? It reminds us there's so much beauty out there. Which we almost never see. I mean, because all you gotta do is look outside. But what's in front of us? <laughs> exactly. To be fair, I'm looking outside and it's but a complete dark night, the so... <laughs> the stars we're seeing have already been dead. It's also ten till For six in the morning. of years. They're all... lies. I wouldn't call them lies, but... <laughs> but that doesn't make them any less beautiful, right? I don't know. If they're not even real, then what's the point? They are real. <laughs> they're just... It's all lies. <coughs> what? Everything. My entire life. Y'all got your shoes on the bed. My dad. <laughs> My mom. I don't know about you guys, like but we had to take our shoes off as soon as we came inside. And that other woman? My real mom? She's the biggest lie of all. I can't trust any of them. I think you're the only one in the world I can trust. I'm honored if that's true. I appreciate it. I know how that feels. I'll take it. Even if it's only by process of elimination. <laughs> Good. I wore this bracelet my entire life. I never even asked why. Never even thought about it. <laughs> Somehow, I think I always knew. Even when I didn't know. <laughs> that my real mother was gone. Man, that's gotta suck. Still take your shoes off. You're getting your bed all nasty. The fact that she's here right now. That she came here. For me, I think I need to see her. Is that wrong? I, I can't tell you what to feel. I still stand by that. All of you should do like a a, 
a fucking meet and greet kind of thing. No. It's, of course not. It's not. But it, it might be tough to track her down. Yeah. That's true. Tough to track Luckily, her down? She's all over I've fucking town. What weapon. do you mean? But what if we can't find her? It's a small ass town. It's not like I can ask my dad. I have no idea where to start. You can ask Frank. Because, I mean, he's still obviously dealing to her. She walked out of his RV. I think I know what to do. Yeah, call Frank. I'll call Frank and get him to connect us to her. You do that? I'll give it a shot. Why not? It's all or nothing, right? Of course, even if we know where she is, we need a way to get to her. I can't just ask my parents for a ride. Y'all got feet. I... Sure. Don't worry. I've got that one covered, too. My <laughs> rusty heat. You do? Yep. In fact, anything you could come up with, I'll handle it. <laughs> I know you will. But even if we find her, how will I talk to her? What do I say? Hi. Thanks for picking money and drugs over your spawn. Is a great way to start it, I guess. You'll know. After my dad died. You'll figure it out. I was worried I wouldn't know how to talk to him anymore. But somehow, when we speak, I always know what to say. <laughs> you know, when I'm making s'mores when with speak, him, when I'm sitting in the back in seat dreams, with him. He's there. And it's so real. It's almost like it's another part of my life. It used to be the only part that mattered. I've never told anyone about that. Weird, huh? Uh, sure. Rachel? I was just thinking... Maybe I was wrong before. <laughs> Who cares if the stars are dead? As long as we can still see them, that means they're real. To us. Right? Sure. Right. Well, I mean, what seeing is believing. That's how most people go, I guess. Is Diddy back? Am I having another Diddy nightmare dream? Diddy! Good morning! Aw, oh, now I'm sleeping on chairs. Shit's hard as fuck. Diddy, you're, you're missing your steering wheel. <laughs> you silly. You can't drive us into a truck that Dad, way. I think we're stuck. Hey, maybe you should let me drive. <laughs> you yeah. always do it wrong. <laughs> that was one time. When are you going to let it go? It was one time. Many times over. Remember when we used to work on cars together? Those are some of my favorite memories. Oh, that's why she's half mechanic. Don't you mean my memories? I don't think you remember after... You're dead. Touche. 
Yeah. All right, you win. Why don't you go take a look? You sure? What am I taking a look at? <laughs> I like how she plays with the immersion too. She's like, all right, <laughs> let me drive <laughs> and step out of the car. <laughs> She's improv queen at heart. Pop the hood. What's wrong with her? Ugh. When was your last oil change? What's wrong? Don't you see anything? <laughs> well, <laughs> yeah, no, it's right here. Fine. It's, it's a spark plug. No, that's not it. I just had that replaced. Isn't improv supposed to be all about yes and? Yes and what? Yes and he just had Dad, it replaced. Stop. He just said that. N none of this is real. You're not real. It's your breaker. Rachel's fluid. family isn't real. This whole thing, it, it's, it's all just theater. Well, you know what William Shakespeare said. Did I just call him Breaker? <laughs> but my name, it, 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 no work, no good. Um. The world the stage? Something about the whole world being a stage. So might as well act the fuck out of it. Nailed it. But I don't want to be an actor. I just want to be myself. Give me a break. Hmm. Well... Maybe there's a reason we pretend. Maybe the lies we tell each other are less horrible than the truths we keep hidden. Wow. That's pretty dark, Dad. Where do you think you get it from? There's my cue. Dad? Relax, sweetie. It's all pretend, right? Right. Just a bit of stage magic. Floodlights, sound effects. Chloe, look at me. Look at me, sweetheart. It's going to be okay. <laughs> that wasn't stage <laughs> magic. Oh. If that was stage magic, she just gave the performance of her life. Boo! <laughs> home sweet home. Oh, she got the cool background too. Okay, I saw Sarah leaving Frank's RV. He might know how to find her. Hey, Chloe. Plus, he likes me, and he owes me one from yesterday. I can do this. Chloe, don't, don't you think that we should, like, shower? Oh, come on, dude. Because Pick up. we have been in a couple Frank, days. I got your collector's fee. Coming to get it? Hey, Frank. I was actually gonna cash in for a favor instead. What do you say? Never run out of crap, do you? What's the problem? I need to find that woman from yesterday. Sarah. Frank? What the hell for? Something important. Can you help? Uh, I don't think he's going to care about either of these options. Why would he care if it means a lot to Chloe or that he's helping a friend? Or that she's I'm helping a, to a, help friend. a friend. 
It would mean a whole lot to her. The girl with you at the mill? <sighs> Maybe. Yeah. I'll meet you in the junkyard in two hours. <sighs> Sweet. Thanks, man. You're a real... <sighs> that went well. I guess. What am I getting myself into? To be honest, I don't know. But I don't have a good feeling about it. Okay, I've got two hours to kill. A shower would be fucking amazing. Oh, bro, that's what I was just saying. You haven't showered in fucking forever. Okay, 20, 21. Fishy, there's a fishy. Okay, um, the laundry is disgusting, disgusting. Oh, water that plant. Don't overwater it. We learned our uh, lesson. Better than nothing. You know what, I regret it. Immediately regret it. Giving a plant pop probably isn't the best. You're welcome, plant. You didn't even name your plant. Why don't you put it in the window so it can thrive? Figures. Winchester High School gives Fisher Award to Sarah. Um, what? Oh, that's nice to see good. my work is appreciated. Ah, I get it. A further layer of nuance. <laughs> Nathan almost pissed himself. Yeah. Thou art an idiot. Yeah. <laughs> Thou art an idiot. Whoa. Skips in a band? Yeah, that was one of the things that we didn't, we didn't do. I was not aware that you could, to be honest. Out we get. Are we not gonna grab Is clothes? Mom playing music? Hmm. Huh. What? Stop being an asshole then. Stop being an asshole. Easy. Simple. Is that David's <laughs> towel? <laughs> Where the hell is mine? Just get a new okay. towel. My towel's probably in here somewhere. I should just calmly look for it. Tub? <sighs> Score. Dude, did you get a new towel? Max and I were so into this shit when we were kids. Oh, is this when she Wait, dyes her hair? Captain Bluebeard's hair dye. Max Bombshell was blue. To make me a pirate, but we never got around to it. Ooh! Ready that... for the best shower of my life. Back straight. Hot water. Back. Don't let me down. Gross. Pommy. Okay. Get the shower of your life. If your towel is under there though, I hope it's clean. I hope it's been washed. Because if not, 
That's nasty. You should always wash it after every shower anyway. Because it'll just carry the bacteria because it's wet and then dry and wet and dry and wet and dry. It's gross. You also don't have a bath, man. Pretty sure that's not how you die here, but okay. Plus, you only started with a bit of hair. That's gonna get all over everything, though. I need no clothes. And so you're going into still Joyce's? I like that dragon. That was cool looking. So there's the skull, dragon. What are the bonus ones? <laughs> the exact same one. Okay. I like the dragon. So let's look at the other ones. What we got? What we got? What we got? That looks familiar. Did she wear that in the original game? All right. Oh, she... one last thing. I'm so used to pressing. I need to get Dad's tool back. so I can fix that truck. Dad's toolbox want, should be in I the want... garage downstairs. That's great. I wanna. I wanna get dressed. I wanna look at the cone of fire. Wait. Whoa. Not gonna lie, kinda like it. I kinda, kinda like it. Let's see the dragon. Might actually go with the cone of fire. I wish you could, like... Combine different things. Oh, I like the dragon. I'm gonna leave All the right. dragon. One last. I don't thing. like the jacket. I need to get Dad's tools so I can fix that truck. Dad's toolbox should be in the garage downstairs. Yeah, that's great. I I don't like the jacket. I really wish I could change the jacket. I'd switch the jacket out for the the cone one dad's jacket put that shit on it might be better dad's favorite jacket definitely taking that if rachel and i ever leave put it on put it on it's better than this shit joyce in our room oh no we were in here Car calendar? Oh, you know we don't fuck it up. Oh. Really good for. Uh, hitting on chicks. Joyce, new husband's cheating. I know he's a boyfriend, but he becomes a husband. Your new husband's cheating. Hitting on chicks. <laughs> what a bombshell. Jeez. Okay, alright, okay. Got a little bit of a sense of humor. No way. Mom actually sold her ring? For $300. Hey man, money's tight. I remember this. Mom loved it. Wait. Is today Mother's Day? 
Shit. Today's Mother's Day. Oh, no. <laughs> oh. This card is redeemable for a free breakfast in bed. Love you, William. It was May of 05. It's been scientifically proven you're officially the best mom in the world. Happy Mother's Day. That's cute. Um, dress fair? Shit. So folded. David really is moving it. So, if I put this photo out, Mom just hides it in a different drawer? What the hell? That's... Again, you don't know that... That's not her way of coping with things. It might affect her Here differently goes. than it affects you. What are the chances I can avoid Mom or David? Given that there's music blaring from down there, I'm pretty sure it's slim. <laughs> <laughs> I'm flipping them over. <laughs> Not yet. I told you three minutes each side. They're gonna burn. Oh, you're the expert now. I can't stand it. I'm telling you, it'll make a mess. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, they look happy. You know, you don't have to make me breakfast. I'd settle for flowers. You cook all the time. I want you to have a break at home. <laughs> you are one class act, David Madsen. <laughs> Mom actually looks pretty happy right now. She does look happy. And I have a feeling Chloe's gonna ruin this for her. By pulling a Chloe. Because she doesn't like when other people are happy. Hey, who's there? Hey. Chloe, your hair. When did you, was this for the play? I heard you performed last night. Nope. I mean, I, I did, but this is, uh, is something different. None of that matters now. Oh, I am so glad to see you. Good to see you, Chloe. Coming home was a smart decision. Shut up. Happy Mother's Day, Joyce. I hope you have a great day. Happy Mother's Day, Mom. Thank you, sweetheart. I... Uh, I didn't get you anything. Having you back home is present enough. Aww. I'm just here to pick up something. Then I... Uh, I have to go. Are you coming home tonight? Mom... I I don't know. I wish you would tell me what you're up to. I'm hanging out with Rachel. I'm... I'm just hanging out with Rachel. Oh, how is Rachel? I was telling David about the play and you being in it. I... She's I gotta kind go. of rough. Listen, wait. Before you go... David has something to say to you. Oh. It won't take but a minute. I'll listen for Mom. you. So, Chloe, let's hear it. I, uh, I don't have time for this now. Hold on a minute. Please. I owe you an apology. Is it going to be your actual apology? 
Chloe, I should not have asked you to empty your pockets yesterday. I was, uh, out of line. And... Facts. I'm sorry. Facts. Sure. Why not? Okay. Apology accepted. Really? Yeah. Good job. And good job, Mom, for twisting his arm or whatever. Chloe. What? It's great. He listens to you. Can we be done now? Wait. One second. Don't go, Chloe. Okay. I've been... meaning to show you something. Maybe... maybe now's a good time. Actually, I'm kind of busy. This... is my friend Phil Becker. Okay. We served in the same unit. Two tours. Yippee. Becker was killed near the end of our deployment. Roadside IED. Mm. We used to joke about all the trouble we were going to get into once we got back home. But he died. He died and I didn't. And I think about that fact every damn day. The point is, I've had my share of grief. I know what you're going through. Mm. So I guess what I'm saying is, I'm here to do what, whatever I can to help you get over the loss of your dad. Thanks, but maybe you need Please, to work on your wording next I'm time. I'm begging you. Give David a chance, won't you? As long as he stops being Here. a sexist pig. Why don't you keep this photo for a little while? I might be willing to try. Think about what I've said. Yeah, sure, why not? Do it for mom. Do it for Joyce. It's Mother's Day. David looks so Be young. Be good to her. And this Phil guy. They look close. Thank you, David. Oh, Chloe. Mom. I'm just so proud. Give your you mother both. a hug. Mom. I really need to go. Be careful. <laughs> that out there, poor Chloe. lady needs one. I love you, sweetheart. All right. All right. Bye, Joyce. Hope you great day. Have what a good Mother's Day. The hell. What is all this? What the fuck is all this? A sack just gotta of, grab dad's toolbox and just then a get out of here. Sack of rice. <laughs> What's the matter, David? Don't want any more decorations inside <laughs> your toolbox. I forgot we did that. Oops. That is where we're gonna end it. Hope you guys have a great day or night, depending on what time you're watching. And for today's your birthday, happy birthday. Like and subscribe if you like this. Have a safe flight home. See you next season.